Hi guys, it's Sebastian here from Noble Frugal Studio, and I've been using Opatunes for almost two years now, so I decided to combine all of my thoughts on the software in comparison with its other animation software options in order to give you guys a full featured Opatunes review. Now I'm going to be judging Opatunes on four factors, which are price, learning curve, functionality and workflow, and my overall judgment. So first off for price, it's pretty easy because Opatunes is the only full featured and full functioning animation software for free right now on the market. So to be honest, it kind of beats all its other alternatives such as, you know, Animate CC and Toon Boom in price, hands down. Now I know there are other free animation softwares on the web right now like Synfig and Tupi, but none of those really come close to Opatunes' potential and ability. You know, Opatunes come, kind of comes closer to the Toon Boom and Animate CC level rather than a traditional flipbook software. Secondly, for the learning curve of Opatunes, sadly I have to say that it's pretty darn steep. Back when Opatunes came out and on March 26, 2016, I had no idea how to even approach the software. It took me a long time to get used to and such. So as you can see, Opatunes uses a traditional X sheet rather than a timeline, which is kind of just like a timeline going vertical. And it also uses levels and columns rather than like, you know, just having an animation library where you can access all your animations and also the use of layers in a lot of photo editing softwares and animation softwares. So as a verdict, Opatunes' learning curve is very, very steep, but if you really do want to be an animator and just don't have the cash, it's definitely worth it. So as for the workflow in Opatunes, it's quite smooth, complete with customizable shortcuts and all the kinds of brushes someone could ask for. However, because Opatunes is still new to the open source market and the market in general, there's still some glitches that are when running some of the more complex tasks. So right now I don't exactly know what makes Opatunes glitch or there are some things when you're just in a pro middle of a project and it might crash so I definitely recommend saving your progress very very often as I do or putting on the automatically save feature which has worked out for me in the long run okay guys so there's actually one thing that I forgot which is almost like uh, a fifth uh, factor which I'm gonna judge Opentunes, which is the Opentunes' features. Now, Opentunes is completely full featured just as Toon Boom or Animate CC. You can do frame by frame, you can do cutout animation, flash and flash type animation. Um, really all this is possible in Opentunes. I just want to make that clear for you guys so you don't think that you know it's just like a like I said before, a flipbook kind of software you just kind of draw the next frame, draw. No, you can do anything you can really do in the mainstream software is in Opentunes, which is why it's such a great opportunity opportunity for us animators who just don't have the kind of money. <laughs> Overall the software has its ups and downs but it's totally worth trying out. Coming from experience with the software it really has potential so be sure to download Opentunes if you guys are interested. I've started a new tutorial series just for you guys beginning in Opentunes so be sure to check that out if you guys really want to start animation and making your dreams come true. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.